Death comes to one and all. That's a morose thought. Death is a loss and it can hurt. But Christians see death differently. What's your theology of death? During my days as a university president, we weathered the death of a student in a tragic traffic accident. We grieved and prayed God would give the family grace sufficient to the need. This time caused us to consider the reality of death and its meaning. Scripture says death is the wages of sin, the result of the fact that we live in a fallen world. As the old McGuffey readers said, in Adam's fall, we sinned all. We are born in sin, and death is the inevitable consequence. In the Bible, death is described as an enemy. It's a separation. It hurts. We don't have to like it. It's okay to grieve. But here's the spiritual irony and the blessing. Unlike any other enemy, we don't have to fear death. The Nazis were enemies and we feared and fought them. But death is an already conquered enemy. Christ defeated death at his resurrection. So for the Christian, absent from the body, present with the Lord. Death is not an end, but a glorious transition. We have hope, what the scripture calls the blessed hope.